Hi, I'm Eric from Stinger. Today we're going to show you the differences between our two heightened installation kits that we have for Jeep Wrangler JK. We'll discuss the differences between the display mounting method and the wiring. By the end of our video, you'll understand the differences between these two kits and you'll know which one's right for your Jeep. The original mounting kit for the Heighton in the Jeep used the universal mounting method. For this, we take the Heighton radio module and we attach a bracket to that. Then the display is clipped onto that bracket. This results in the Heighton display sitting a few inches out from the dash. Many people refer to this as a floating display. This is popular in many of today's vehicles like Audi, BMW, Toyota, and many more. If you're interested in a more factory type of appearance, our new Heighton kit is designed to incorporate the Heighton into the dash, making it look like it came from the factory this way. This new kit also greatly simplifies the installation because all of the wiring is plug and play. The original kit requires making wiring connections between the Heighton harness and the vehicle harness. So you have to connect 14 wires between the two harnesses. These connections require either crimping or soldering. The new harness is completely plug and play, which plugs directly into the Jeep wiring and plugs directly into the height. This ensures that your wires are connected correctly, stay connected, and saves you about 10 minutes or so of wiring on the bench. Both of our Jeep JK installation kits are completely compatible with the Heighton Multimedia Infotainment Unit. So whether you're looking for a factory, sleek, integrated design, or if you're looking for more of a tablet-style mount, both of these kits will offer great feature upgrades for your Jeep. 